Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon. In this video, I'll be opening up a Burning Shadows Pokemon Booster Box. This Booster Box opening is part of my 20 Pokemon Booster Box opening series I'm currently doing for the summer of 2018 on my channel. This is the first of the two Burning Shadows Booster Boxes that I'll be opening up. I did purchase this booster box from Troll and Toad for $89.95. The Burning Shadows set was released in August of 2017 and is the third main expansion in the Sun and Moon series sets. It is based around both Ho-Oh and Necrozma. One of the reasons I'm really looking forward to opening this box is to try and pull the Charizard GX Rainbow Rare. That card is worth over $150. So the plastic wrap is off of the booster box. You can see some of the featured Pokemon within this set. 36 booster packs inside this box. Ho-Oh GX is in the set. Tapu Fini GX. Necrozma GX, of course. So lots of competitive cards in the set. This is easily one of the top three most competitive sets in the Sun and Moon series of sets. Here's a look at all 36 booster packs. I'll start with the right stack first. Marshadow on the very first pack in the box. There are two different versions of the code cards in these packs. This would be a white colored code card, TCGO after the Pokemon.com URL. That indicates at least a rare hollow in that final spot. 4 and 2 is a card trick to move the two better cards to the back of the pack. Venipede to start the first pack. Horsey. Mudbray. Lediba. Hoot Hoot. Fairy type energy. Guzma. You can pull a Guzma full art in this set as well. Whirlipede. Tormenting Spray. Reverse Solo of a Porygon 2, which isn't uncommon. And the first rare would be a Dusnor, and this is a rare hollow. Of course, I'll summarize all of my good pulls at the end of the opening. Necrozma pack now. Togemaru to start the second pack. Wimpod, an excellent card here to get to Glycopod GX. Meowth. Magikarp, the always powerful. Krogunk. Fire type energy, tormenting spray, Lana, heat more, reverse solo of another Lana. This is an uncommon, and the final card would be a Toxicroak. Back to a Mars Shadow cover artwork design. Duskull to start this pack. Morlo, Caterpie, Merrill, Rhyhorn. Grass type energy, bodybuilding dumbbells, metapod, wishful baton, reverse solo of a mudbray, just a common, and the rare here would be a Malamar. I am looking forward to the upcoming season of the Pokemon TCG, the 2019 standard format. Of course, Sun and Moon base set and newer expansions are eligible for that format. Lots of good trainer cards will be rotated out. Things such as Floatstone, for example. Professor Sycamore will be a big supporter that everyone will miss. Meowth to start this pack. Magikarp. Krogunk. Pikachu. Panseer. Fighting type energy. Potown. Dusclops. Charmeleon. Reverse Solo of a Rotom Dex, which is an uncommon, and the rare here would be a Dark Rye GX, so the first ultra rare pull of this opening. Of course, there is a regular Charizard GX in this set. There is not a Charizard GX full art. It is available as a Black Star promo. Tapu Fini pack now. Noibat to start this one. Alolan Grimer, Riolu, Cutiefly, Dupiter, Metal Type Energy, Bouffalant, Electric, Rhydon, Reverse Solo, of a Lycanroc, pretty good pull here, Rare Reverse Solo, and the final card would be a Ledian. 
Necrozma pack now and lots of different forms of Necrozma in the Pokemon TCG. Dawn Wings, Dustmane, and Ultra Necrozma. All decent cards out there as GX cards. White colored code card here. Take a look at the front there. That's what I mean by a white colored code card. Noibat to start this pack. Stuffle. Mudbray. Tynamo. Oddish. Fairy type energy. Simus Age. Weakness policy. Porygon 2. Reverse Hollow of a Sneasel, just a common. And the final card here would be an Alolan Mach GX. So the second regular GX pull of this opening. I'll set that one aside. Neither of those two cards are that competitive. But as a collector, always hoping to add more Ultra Rares and Secret Rares to my collection. Riolu to start this pack. Cutie Fly. Dupider, Togedemaru, Wimpod, Water-type Energy, Electabuzz, Noctowl, Simapore, Reverse Hollow of a Magikarp, the always powerful, just a common, and the rare here would be a Tangrowth. Ho-Oh cover artwork pack now. In one of my decks, I use Ho-Oh GX, I combine that with Kiawe to quickly set up a fire type Pokemon like Ho-Oh. Ho-Oh has an advantage because it is not weak to water type Pokemon. Sandy Gas to start this pack. Venipede. Sneasel. Alolan Vulpix. Horsey. Darkness type Energy. Ribombi. Guzma. Whirlipede. Reverse Hollow of a Weavile, which is a rare. Pretty good card in the TCG as well. And the final card would be a Mudsdale. Tapu Fini pack now. Another green colored code card. This is what I mean by a green colored code. Porygon to start this pack. Panpour. Pansage. Esper. Sock. Water type energy. Heatmore. Simisir, Mount Lanakila, Reverse Hollow, of a Togedemaru, which is a common, and the rare here would be a Broxish. About halfway through the first 18 packs of this booster box. Not anything too great pulls wise yet. Hoping to get a couple of full art cards as well as a secret rare. GX Rainbow Rare or maybe a secret rare trainer. Sneasel to start this pack. Alolan Vulpix, Horsey, Noibat, Alolan Grimer, Lightning-type Energy, Lunatone, Olivia, Curlia, Reverse Hollow of a Kingdra. There we go, another rare Reverse Hollow. That is the third one so far. And the final card would be a Butterfree. Marshadow Pack now. Tynamo to start this one. Crab Roller. Lediba. Inke. Caterpie. Darkness type energy. Tremulian. Tormenting Spray. Lana. Reverse Hollow. Of a Crabomitable. There we go. Another rare reverse solo. And the final card would be that same Crabomitable. So the same card back to back there. It actually happens more than you'd think. Ho-Oh pack now. Whenever I open up Evolutions booster packs, I'm always hoping that'll happen with Charizard going rare reverse hollow into the rare hollow. Krogunk to start this pack. Pikachu. Panseer. Charmander. Alolan Rattata. Psychic type energy. Rotom Dex. Seedra. Plumeria, Reverse Solo, of a Simisir, which is an uncommon, and the rare here would be a Lycanroc, and this is a rare holo. I have pulled that card as a Reverse Solo already. Tapu Fini pack now. This pack starts with Inke, Lediba, Caterpie, Sandygast, Venipede, 
fire type energy, Porygon 2, Potown, Dusclops, Reverse Hollow of a Mount Lanakila, which is an uncommon, and the rare here would be a Heracross. Next pack here. Four packs left to go after this one. Should be getting about one or two more good pulls. Merrill to start this pack. Hoot Hoot. Rhyhorn. Ralts. Tangela. Grass type energy. Sophocles. Electabuzz. Super Scoop Up. Reverse Hollow of a Panseer, just a common. And the rare here would be an Electros. Marshadow pack now. White colored code card. Let's see what happens in this pack. Dupiter to start it. Togedemaru. Wimpod. Meowth. Magikarp. Fighting type energy. Whirlipede. Simisage. Weakness policy. Reverse solo of a Sophocles, which is an uncommon. And the rare here would be a Gyarados, and this is a rare holo. Set that one aside. Three rare holo pulls so far. Ho o -Oh pack now. And even if I don't pull the Charizard GX Rainbow Rare out of this box, I still have a chance in the second box that I'll be opening up later this summer, maybe even into the fall. Chances are not very good that I'll actually pull that card. Rhyhorn to start the pack. Ralds. Tangela. Tynamo. Crab Roller. Fairy type energy. Soul Rock. Simipore. Bodybuilding Dumbbells, Reverse Hollow, of a Dark Ride, there we go, another rare Reverse Hollow, and the final card would be a Turtonator. Second to last pack now. Duskull, doing the dab there to start the pack. Esper, Morlow, Charmander, Porygon, Darkness Type Energy, Curlia, Rabombi, Guzma, Reverse Hollow of an NK, just a common, and the final card would be a Raichu, and this is a rare holo. Do not like facing this card in battle. You can use Devolution Spray along with that Raichu and continuously paralyze your opponent's active Pokemon. Final pack here in part one, then on to part two. Looks like it is an average start to this box overall. The second half should be a little bit better with the number of ultra rares. Horsey to start the final pack. Noibat. Alolan Grimer. Riolu. Cutiefly. Psychic type energy. Wick. Mount Lanakila. Wishful Baton. Reverse Solo of a Meryl, just a common. And the final card would be Beware. So I can summarize my pulls now. Quantity wise, about average, but overall not that great of cards. So in part one, I was able to pull out five rare reverse solo. Started off with Darkrai, Crabomitable, Kingdra, Weavile, and then Lycanroc. I was able to pull out four rare holo in Raichu, Gyarados, Lycanroc, and then Dustnor. And I was only able to pull two Ultra Rares out, both regular GX, Alolan Muck and Darkrai. So to summarize the pulls in part one again, I was able to pull out five rare Reverse Holo, four rare Holo, and two regular GX. So that concludes this video. Thanks everyone for watching. As always, before you go, make sure to check out all the links in the description of this video, including links to my blog, Facebook, and Twitter pages. So thanks everyone for watching, and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.